with my quest to not die as Russia. Oh, that works. We kind of annex a lot of territory from the Yagabadabas. Mm, now we're dealing with the problem with forgetting about overextension. But so far, so not dead. Da -da -da. Don't lose this battle. Okay, good. To Narva. Narva. Never heard of it. This was at one point I had to annex it, but oh well. Um, how long am I going to wait? Apparently not any longer. Call to arms against East Francia, Asturias, Visigothic, West Indies. Um, East Francia is allied with Bulgaria? Oh. Against them. And then East Francia is allied with France is the defender of the Catholic faith. Basically, except call to arms to go to war with everyone over here. Uh, if you we would join as a regular ally, we would not it will be twice as expensive for the enemy to take our provinces, but we will not be able to call our own allies. The question now becomes, do I value Pomerania's friendship, and do I believe in them? What's their tech? 12, compared to like 13. Us. Do I really want these guys rampaging through my lands and killing me? Can I risk it? And to get through Pomerania, then there's only me. And now they're just attacking because these guys aren't Catholic. Well, <sighs> Hollis is just north. I need Pomerania. Except. Don't freaking get me killed, Pomerania. Wait, this means I can raise war taxes. Hey. That reduces my money expenses. Okay. That helps. Um. Lose the Diplo power. I can deal with that. Okay. So far, so good huddling around. <sighs> okay, good. Their ships should ships should totally block anyone trying to kill me. <sighs> tiny Russia is tiny. Big Russia will be big one day. Until then, we're tiny Russia. The tiniest of the tiny Russias. Well, probably not the tiniest, but... Uh, there are mean times to happen, I assume. Uh, less religious unity than currently at 24% progress. Progress is at plus one each month. Ew. Has at least one unrest, has no current disasters, will give stability cost modifier and minus some good produced nationally and some probably extremely annoying events. Okay, let's upgrade our cannons finally. Yeah, I don't really care. I don't care about my large number of diplomatic relations. about that's yeah, unimportant I'll just turn down the speed and then find out what Eric is talking about hmm what okay <laughs> oh okay so that's it
Okay, anyway. Wait, siege? Ah, okay, get that siege f from fighting. Uh -huh. So far, so not screwed. So it's unknown land in there. Ooh, my odds, are you? Ooh, my odds. Parthias didn't take a whole lot from the Staffords. Instead, they're taking a lot from, um... Baranid? Is that really what they're called? That's the province. From Palace? Hmm. Okay. Let's do the speed up now. Lose some Diplo power. Uh -huh. Manage. Make core. Make core. These are all 8%. Except for this one, it's 4%. Mm -hmm. Come on, core them quickly. Quickly so we don't have to deal with massive rebellions as much. Or as massive rebellions. That we can get back to being Russia. The really expansionist country is going to make it. Country before faith. Um, no, there's no need for such underhanded tactics. I don't want to risk them backstabbing us, especially not with all this going on. Or less by defense could mean better support roles, could mean we're even more screwed. Getting closer to normal. Uh huh. Why are so many discoveries spreading? It has the Protestant Reformation going. Good. Good. Mm hmm. Origin and Zara is being converted to Protestant by nearby Center of Reformation. So the center, the heart of the Reformation is here, so I suppose in a certain area it randomly adds the Protestant Reformation. That's kind of interesting. What would happen if con if it converts Rome? So Protestant Rome had place where the Catholic is centered. And there aren't any papal states, so just Italy. Could be interesting. Catholics, Sunni, that weird religion. Ibadati is that a religion or just like a word? Coptic, Sunni, Zoroastrian, Mycians, uh huh, uh huh. Hey, we're winning. We're winning. We're winning. It looks like Easter Antia. Oh, good for you. Okay, then. Uh, there aren't any more rebellions. And we should be good. Thought this to be a lot more dangerous. Dude, wait a minute. No, pause. Lose some legitimacy, gain some tax modifier. Eh, I can afford to lose the legitimacy. Yeah, but, um, hello, you're attacking me, whoever you are, Bulgaria. Oh, Bulgaria. Do I have any claims on you? No. So, how much do I want to fight you? Ah, uh, let's bring down these guys. I'll leave you there while you go down. Uh, actually, I'll move you up to Kusk. So that's an already core, which isn't. Okay, good. Then I'll switch the armies out with each other. Okay. So no national tax modifier. Sounds good. Pay a loan? Oh, hey, it's not, my loan situation isn't too bad. Huh. 
things aren't nearly as bad as I thought they would be right now. You know, stop training or gaining troops. Stop with your troop regen. Where's your tech? 14. So you do have higher tech. So you can go up there. Um, with no leader. And you with the best leader can come down here. place would be in Siege uh, Mutinia. That should block the wind. Da -da 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 -da. We haven't totally lost this at all. Hey, if they can expand into East Francia's land, that'd be nice. Parthius, end of Peasants' War. Huh. I'm gonna a Peasants' War. Oh well. That's good for them, I guess. Mm-hmm. Let's go that army. Good more. Good. It's nice, we're actually contributing. Hey, you can repay our loans. Yay! Hire a free one. Uh-huh. That's pretty good. Oh. Get expensive. Wait, you're my ally? Allied with Pomerania. Oh. Mm hmm. Well, they've apparently been improving relations with me. If I could get them to vas if I could vassalize them, then that might be worthwhile. Mm-hmm. Actually, I suppose I should wipe this out. I need to have like 20 men. So I'll kill this stack now, and then later would be good. Royal of Armies, yes please. Uh-huh. Oh. Um stop nations. Um how do I annex? I mean I know how I annex, but do I have to be cannot when we're at war. Okay, so once we get out of this war then I'll start to annex. I should remember that I can annex. Oh, hi, Pomerasia. Or Pomerasia. Pomerania! Not Pomerasia. No such thing as Pomerasia. Place I apparently made up. In my mind. Mm hmm. Sounds legit. Uh, you should probably kill those, whoever they are, who are enemies in there. And yeah, good. Mm hmm. Woo. Russia. Now to get the biggest name ever in Russian history. <laughs> Our font shall be the largest in the land. Mm hmm. Largest font in the land. Do do do, unpausing and so kind of singing. Guess I sing a lot. At least talk in a singy e voice. Ooh, I have an idea. What is this? Time to fabricate claim. So it's that or some really outdated technology. Yeah, I'll get that. And what's the total effect? Oh, uh, yeah. Wait, unjustified demands? That's when you get over 100% war score. 
Is that gonna potentially do over 100% war score? Oh, that could be great. Sounds very powerful, if I'm interpreting it right. Wait, is it just me now? Did they peace out? Okay, good. I was about to say. As long as I fully siege Pomerania, then I'll be fine. Oh, hey, Slavonia. I'll go siege them. Mm hmm. I'll get it. <laughs> um, diplomacy. No, not religion. Diplomacy. Okay, good. I'm going to switch their places. Where am I? Eh, oh well. I won't be that big of a deal. Wait a minute, France! How many free star generals do you have, France? It's one, two, three three star generals. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Why? When did France get here? I guess I'll have to send you guys um, to go down here so my troops are all close together. Ugh. That's good. And Portland. I thought you had it blockaded, or did they walk through you? You're just that dumb enough to let them walk through you. 7,000 versus 70,000 70, French troops. <laughs> they just walked through you, didn't they? Gold or stability? Gold. Uh, maybe I'll be able to build my embassy if it weren't for France. France! Queen, we have won the siege of Moldovia. Good. Siege de Madovia. It's probably not even proper Spanish. It's just random Spanish sprinkled into English. Mm hmm. So, see, I need you down there. The split into over there. And I could split. You in have to go and cover there. Okay. Now we're losing. Although they don't take anything from me. I mean, they shouldn't, but you never know. Uh huh. At least we're so technically winning the war. Even if we're not going to win, probably. These five my predictions. Because France. I am only Russia so much. I don't quite have a ginormous army. Wait, it's it. France is over here. And now they're over here. How do they get everywhere so fast? Do they have forced march? I assume they have forced march, maybe. I suppose I'd have to check the leather. The leather. The ledger for that. Oh, hey. Yeah, rebels. Stop the Hollis. Mm hmm. Huh. Fine, I got this. Go away, Pomerania. Do your thing. Win this war. Or lose it better. That's good. Alright, 
No, I'm not on Iron Man mode, so I couldn't get the achievement for uh, defeating a three-star general without an army. Or without a general, by walking like a massive 80 stack into that. Oh well. I suppose I can't since this is a quote-unquote a mod because it's a converted save. But oh well. Uh, no use crying over what can't be done. Mm-hmm. I mean... You have no diplomats to send. Oh, so that's why I can't suggest an offer. Well, hopefully Pomerania makes a good one and ends this war soon. Before we all lose. Well, Krakowa, where is even Krak Krakowa from? You know, Krakowa, where are you from? Attacker, no, Krakowa? And where's Krakowa? Okay, that seems pure Krakowa. Oh, uh, well, find Krakowa later, maybe. So I don't understand why Hollis keeps on wanting to expand to Scandinavia. It's mine. It's my Scandinavia. A little bit of Pomerasia. Pomerania scattered in there. Uh, yeah, fortification efforts are nice. Means we're more fortified against this. This massive European force of doom. These Byzantine new full annex Bulgaria. Try to kill me with Bulgarian land, giving me borders with Byzantium, giving better ways for them to attack me than through Alena. Hmm. Mm hmm Could probably be making cores right now. In fact, should be. 12% over extension for all of these. Well, that should bring us relatively close to being safe. Oh, good. We're no longer. So that was at least one unrest, so we can't have an internal conflict again. Or we're no longer at risk for that. We're not on that risk population. Combine. You can go there. Uh huh. Okay, so who do we declare peace with? Anyone? No? Oh, Bulgaria. Again, land out of it? Just get this land for me? Somehow? They gave me this land. How nice of them. Thank you, AI. Yeah, well, I'll take it. Not like I want. I suppose I should now have you just be stationed there. Uh, yeah, it's nice that it's mine now. What that do? Are you kidding me? That was 24% war scores worth of land. You're putting me at you're putting me in the danger zone. So I think that's a song, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. Didn't want to actually have ads that might make money potentially in like a million years. I would actually put that in here. Now it's on the assumption that it would be legal to have like a sampling of it. But oh well. I suppose it is that I'd actually have to find the song. Mm-hmm. Uh, Estonia? Up to that Estonia. Only 6,000. Oh well. Yeah, you should kill those East Francians that uh, undoing your siege. And uh... Slavonia should probably be given to me. 
<laughs> Give me. Did they also get me here? I guess. Oh yeah, I have a port down here now. My gosh, I could have influence in this trade node. I was trapped to Novgorod. And I'll end to the North Sea. Which goes to this channel. And ends right here. Essentially, the ending of all trade nodes. That is me. Oh well. Some land from Bulgaria never hurts. Um. Change in policy towards Bar Hamada. Uh huh. Looming disaster. That's gonna take a while. Inflation. Eh, only 1%. Uh huh. Uh, it's getting close to ending the episode. End to 9 o'clock. I suppose this is the last episode of this recording session for me, so hopefully I'll get around to recording more tomorrow morning. Actually, no, not trusting them. I refuse to trust them. It could be evil. That and look at my this. If they were evil, or if anything bad happens, then it could be disastrous for me. Expen oh, exceptional year. Sure, that's fine. More tax, 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 tax on my tax, man. I have tax, tax. What just happened? Probably should have read that. Look like a rebellion. Good. I right, had troops there. Just this time I could actually repair. Prepare. Hello, don't die. No, stop losing. Um, will this help? Okay. Thanks for not dying. Uh, I should check my military tab. How many can I have? Two out of two. Okay. You're not in too much danger compared to, uh, you. Uh-huh. Look out. So I have access to here, although it's more or less meaningless. 32 months. Um, not accepted culture. And the tax income. Eh. I'd be willing to convert that. Muslim musketeer, yeah, yeah. Eh, I don't know it changed. Something did though. Hmm. Yeah, no. Maintain diplomat. Oh, hey, we ended the Pomeranian War. I think they actually took this. They did. We expanded into East Francia. We did it. Yay! Oh, I have my troops here. I, mean, I probably pulled them back to somewhere. Uh, they're down here and then they got pulled. Uh huh. That's good. Disaster because of my overextension. Oh, that? Yeah, that is reasonable. I don't want to give me Orthodox or any Christian religion because it takes for freaking ever to convert. So yeah, Orthodox minus one percent like conversion. Get no monthly progress at all. Add policy. Arcadia. Christian Chinese. Arches complete influence. Real warfare. Christian for enemies and for defense. Or when I complete my religious, I could get cover army round shield race enlist privateers. Who has a military skill of at least three or just complete maritime ideas. Nope. Or confirm 
Talisocracy. Russia must have complete maritime ideas. But, uh, Anything to build? No, but we do gain money, which is always nice to do. To our naval force limit. Only 15. Right to our 112 land force limit. Which I don't plan on expanding anytime soon. There's always. Well, at least we're getting a lot of places. I suppose I should end the video. Well, I will she see you for my tomorrow and for your, hopefully your tomorrow. Maybe your, like, month from now. Probably not, but maybe. Goodbye.